Hey guys, this is one of my jobs here. I go over to Jonathan's house and he's got some ice dams. And I'll say he does. This is a very low pitch roof, as you can see, it's only about a 212. So, new roof and everything else. And he's got that ice dam, uh, he's got the ice shield underneath of the shingles. But still, look at how much ice there is here. It's four inches higher than the gutter. And so, it goes back all the way back here to level. So, this area here, you could stand a drink very easily right here. You can see how level it is. So, all the way down. This is so I didn't want to smash it or hit it with an axe obviously that's the stupidest thing to do but you have to be able to let the sun shine melt this stuff so you have to remove the snow because that's the insulation that keeps it cold and obviously we've got heat loss from the house coming down and then it refreezes because look at the size of these soffits these soffits are large so this is all ventilated and it keeps the cold keeps the snowpack cold but obviously from there the water's going down, refreezing as it gets to the bottom of the roof and piling up and piling up and a little bit more water. And yesterday it was raining, terrible. It was the warmest January 29th in history, all the way back from the 50s, I believe it was. So you can see there's the shingles are down inside and there's hundreds of pounds of ice all the way along this roof. So you can see it's back dripping just over here. This is what we don't want actually coming right through see the aluminum is actually warm and the sunshine is melting it all the way around it you can see same thing here so you can see south you can see this area here because again the shingles are you know this roof is very level almost level you can see in these spots here so this is very very high and it goes all the way down to level you can see they literally almost put all this terror but look underneath look at the water So, it's back dripping. Look at it. So this is why we have to be able to stop this from happening. You can see ice all the way along. So we have to be able to get rid of this, shovel it because it's back dripping right now. It's getting all the way up and behind and leaking. So it's the only way to do it is to get rid of the ice. We did it with a shovel. See you guys.